What's going on everybody? Tex here from Zexy and today we are going to take a quick look at stream elements and their giveaway as well as loyalty features. If you guys have never used stream elements, now is the chance to try it because personally I've used Streamlabs for over a year and at first it was great. It was great, but you know, they started rolling out all these new updates. Now you got to pay for using their overlays and such. And to me, the Streamlabs rendition of OBS is just way too buggy. That's why I moved on to Stream Elements. And since I moved, I've never had any problems. So let's hop on in this. You want to go to StreamElements.com because everything that you do with Stream Elements is usually through their web dashboard. I'm going to connect using my Twitch and you're going to be greeted by the general dashboard, which gives you a quick overlook on your stats and so on and so forth. And on the far left side, you want to scroll down and you want to go to loyalty settings. So the first thing you want to do is you want to activate your loyalty system. So if that slider is gray, go ahead and click on it. Make it blue because blue is a good color. Blue looks good on, on you. Now, after that, you want to come up with a name for your currency. You want to come up with a name for your points. Now, the default name is points. That's lame. On my channel, we use tacos, so we're going to change that to tacos. Now, the amount. How many points should viewers get for watching? This is for every 10 minutes. And if you look on the right side of the screen, you will see viewers will receive five tacos every 10 minutes. Subs will receive five tacos. Yeah, you get it. So on my channel, every 10 minutes of, of watching, you earn 10 tacos. Now, if you are a sub, I mean, people sub to you to help support you. So why not give them a little something back? I put mine at times four. So for every 10 minutes of, of watching, subs get 40 tacos. Now, my follower bonus, tip bonus, sub bonus, chair bonus, host bonus, these are all pretty much self-explanatory. Uh, let's quickly go through that and move on to the giveaways. So the follower bonus, every time someone follows your, your channel, now, if they refollow, it does not count. So it's just the first follow. They get a bonus of however many points you set it to. You come to my channel, you follow, you get 150 points right off the bat. Tip bonus. Now, this is for every dollar that someone tips. You can set it to whatever you want for your points, for your currency, for your cash on your stream. Uh, for for example, on my stream, I have it set to 300. So if someone tips $5, they're getting 1,500 tacos right, right off the bat. Subscriber bonus. Every time a person subs, that's how many tacos that they get. Cheer bonus. This is for every 100 bits. So if someone cheers 100 bits, they will get that many tacos. Host bonus. Whether it's a raid or a host, the person who raided and hosted you will get that many tacos as long as they are following. If they are not following someone totally new, they more than likely won't get it. Now, at the bottom of this, you have ignored users. You can set your stream element spot to ignore users as far as not receiving your points. So I currently have the stream elements chat bot set to ignore so the stream elements chat out will not earn any kind of tacos for being in my stream then when you're done setting all that up just click save now before we move on there's one thing you you need to do go to your chat commands this will be at the very bottom of your left tool of your left side uh tool uh tool bar and you want to make sure you are in the default commands with that being said scroll down till you find exclamation point points okay exclamation point points once you find that wherever this is there we go you want to click on the arrow on the far right or just or just anywhere there just don't click on the slider and you want to change that to reflect what your currency is on my channel i have it set to tacos so it's going to be exclamation point tacos so whenever someone wants to check how many tacos they got how many points they have that's what they will type in chat the command cost, keep it as default. User level set to everyone. Your user cooldown and global cooldown set to whatever you want. Then press save. Now, let's quickly move on to the giveaways because this is something that a couple people have been wanting to find out more information on how to set up. It's really simple. It's really quick. On the left side of your stream, of your stream elements dashboard, this is going to be under the loyalty section. So if you look here, it says loyalty. You want to click on giveaways. 
Now, with that being said, as you as you can see, I've done quite a few giveaways. Uh, re well, that was a year back. We've done more giveaways, just not through this. I've just been doing it through chat. Like, pick a number between one and ten. That's one way of doing it, but it's not really efficient. You want to keep track of your giveaways. So here you are in the giveaway tab, and if you just look at it, it's, it's pretty self-explanatory. The give the giveaway title is what you want to give away. So we are going to put a uh, dirty boxers. Okay, we are going to give away our dirty boxers. Now you can put whatever you want in there for whatever giveaway you are doing, and then the giveaway de the giveaway description. Uh, this is usually just to describe what your giveaway is. Let's say you're giving away a night out on the town, but that's the giveaway title. What the giveaway description for your giveaway is you're giving away a gift card to a restaurant or whatever or whatever the case is. So you just want to fill that out. So let's go ahead and fill it out. Used dirty boxers, only the best for my viewers. There you go. Now the giveaway preview, you can set either a picture or a video. This is, you do not have to have this. You do not have to have a preview. If if you want it in there, uh, go for it. It's not gonna hurt, okay? Um, the reason why they have a giveaway preview is if you share the giveaway link itself and not your stream, people can come to your stream elements page and they could enter the giveaway and it will show a little widget, a little preview, which is nice. It's a nice little feature. Then what I usually do is I give I give everyone their first ticket for free. So if you're giving away, let's say, let's say you're giving away a, a Xbox 360, okay? But you want them to use their points, their current their currency that they earned in your chat. Clicking this will give everybody who is followed their first ticket for free, meaning that they do not have to earn your points in your channel in order to get more tickets. Now, always, always, always trust me on this. Click on send confirmation when buying tickets via chat. Always do that. If you don't, people are going to be like, oh, well, did my did, did my ticket go through? Am I entered into the giveaway? If you click on that. The stream, the stream elements chat bot will give a confirmation in your chat live saying this person entered one ticket into the giveaway, entered 10 tickets into the giveaway. Now you also have subscriber only. Self-explanatory. A giveaway only for your subs. Now the ticket cost. Now if you are one of the people doing a giveaway for the Zexy 13 days of giveaways uh, between now and December 13th, Make sure that the ticket cost is set to zero and the maximum tickets per user is set to one. Now, if this is for your own personal giveaways, you can put that to whatever you want. For each ticket that a person gets, they are going to have to spend whatever ticket cost you put down there. Now, the maximum tickets per user, you can either set it to where everybody has an equal chance. They get one ticket only. Now, with the settings that we have here, that first ticket would be free. They wouldn't have to spend points. Or maybe you want it to go by, hey, you know what? I have some viewers who only have 20 points, but I've got some viewers who have been watching my stream for over a month now, and they have over 5,000 points. So I want to give those guys more of a chance. You can set the maximum tickets per user to 10, 100, 20, whatever you want then subscriber luck this 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 one is kind of it's kind of your way of rigging the system um if you have any subscribers entering the giveaway you could change their chances of winning by by anywhere from just 20 from 20 percent to a hundred to where like you can say that it's open to everybody but you know damn good and well that only a sub will win and then once you're done setting that up, you press create and start, and then here you go. This is your giveaway page. This is uh this is what you will be seeing. For every time someone purchases a ticket or in or enters the giveaway, this will update. It'll show you how many people have entered into the giveaway under giveaway entrance, as well as how many tickets they have. It'll show you how long your giveaway has been live, how many tickets in total ha have been bought, and how many people are in the giveaway. Now, if let's say you are running this giveaway for more than one day, 
and you want to advertise it on Twitter, click on public page. And then it's going to load up the giveaway public page. This is what anybody and everybody can see right here. And they can also buy buy tickets to the giveaway right on, on this page instead of in chat. Just copy the link, go to your social media page, and you can paste it in saying, hey, enter my giveaway, blah, blah, blah. So that's always fun. Da, 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 da. And then let's go ahead and enter the giveaway. See? We just entered the giveaway and we use ex exclamation point in enter or you can use ex little exclamation point ticket and then stream elements replies at text canal if you success you successfully bought one ticket hey white how's it going now with that being said as you can see it it up it updated automatically hey, we have one person in the giveaway who has one ticket purchased and it shows us their username right here now when you are ready to be done with the giveaway you are ready to draw the winner you want to go to this page here all you got to do is go to streamelements.com click on giveaways and you're automatically there and now you want to click on close giveaway at the top right now when you click on close giveaway it will say so in your chat stream at stream elements you can no longer enter the giveaway now that that's all done you want to draw your winner and he wants juice, but you want to draw your winner. Click on draw winner. Boom. Done. It will announce it in chat. It'll also say what that person's percentage was to winning. So given that I was the only person who entered, I had a 100% chance of winning. Uh, there's no other way to go about rigging this besides this whole sub thing. Um, if you, Again, if you were doing the giveaway for the Zexy giveaways, make sure that that subscriber luck is set to zero percent please and of course ticket costs zero max tickets one now let's say the person doesn't want it okay you can draw another winner although there's not there's not enough people in our giveaway here and you can also refund giveaway meaning that this person did not want it and you are not going to draw a new winner refund giveaway means that the giveaway is closed that's it you can also mark giveaway as complete which you always want to do always mark giveaway as complete so you can set up another giveaway in the near future and as you can see here it shows up under our recent giveaways so this has been a improper look at the giveaway feature as well as the loyalty settings on stream elements i'm not going to do much editing for this video any at all besides a couple parts where i like froze up uh, I hope you guys have an amazing day. And if you're not part of Zexy, what are you doing with your life? Join our Discord. We are doing 13 days of Zexy giveaways. And if you guys need help with anything at all, whether you're in the community or not, let us know. We'll be more than happy to create videos on whatever you want. Besides, you know, me dancing, because that's a horrible picture. I will see y'all later.